Michelle, get me the valley reading. Okay. Have they plotted the epicenter yet? Yeah, sure it was. Quite a shock. Yeah. Yeah. Nevertheless, there's no scientific evidence of a 3.1 earthquake can loosen dental fillings. No. Right. Thank you. Walt! Your turn on the PR desk. Yes, that, that's right. Dr. Adams, room 14. He isn't? Um, well, then I'd like to leave a message. Walt! Just a minute, okay? Um, would you have him call Walter Russell at the Seismology Institute? Yeah, it, it's very important. Yes, th thank you. Here's a strange one. Caretaker at the Hollywood Reservoir Dam drowned at the bottom of an elevator shaft. They still haven't figured out what happened. Okay. It's Murray. He looks sick. Just found out Dr. Adams stayed up at the fault an extra day. So? Well, I, I sent some figures in a memo into the director's office late yesterday afternoon. I don't think he's even read them yet. Figures on what? Well, I, I know you'll laugh, but, but I think we're going to have a really big quake. Probably today, tomorrow at the latest. And I wanted Dr. Adams here to back up my computation. Thought you were leaving yesterday, Dr. Adams. We've been held up. But we hope to have most of the instruments planted by noon. Still haven't figured out exactly what it is you fellas are trying to do. It's rather technical. That device records minute variations in seismic waves. Huh. Well, better start my plowing. Thanks again for letting us on your land, Mr. Griggs. Once the trench is filled in, you'd never have known we were here. 